margin call. The part of the movie margin call that sticks out in my mind is, is how Pen B's character is a first-hand witness to everything that happens. He has an inside advantage to be hanging out with the higher executives. And at the end of it, casually tells him that they're probably going to get laid off just like everyone else. After hearing that, he locks himself in a bathroom stall and quietly starts crying. It's a reminder that what happens to people who go swimming with sharks? These people have no loyalty. They are not your friend. And all they care about is money. And they're going to get what comes to them in the end. You have no idea how safe and secure I feel about the AMC squeeze. I have alerts set for 20,000, 50,000, 75,000, and 100,000. Moaz. So I want to add this into a video because a few things here. For one, I want you guys to comment down below. What do you have your sell alert set at? I currently don't have any set at. I'm going to hold on to my shares until we reach very, very large numbers. I really have no plan on selling, honestly, personally, but that's not financial advice, of course. But for this ape right here, down below, they said that every time they post something like this on Twitter or Reddit or anywhere else, they get spammed by millions of bots. It's interesting how angry people get when we talk about AMC in general. Like I've said before, and I will say it again, it's very simple. If someone out there is buying shares of whatever name stock that I personally have no affiliation to, I'm not invested in, I'm not shorting, etc., why would I take the time to go and comment on that stock? It makes no sense to me. It makes no sense why there's so many people trying to drag AMC through the dirt, unless they have a ulterior motive. But just relatively speaking, the amount of hate that you see on the meme stocks, and AMC's particularly, it's very, very weird. Because with AMC, for whatever reason, it brings out the bots by the truckload. If the entire world knows the problem, then why is the entire world so powerless to do anything about the problem, which is a few, few greedy, corrupt, disgusting people at the top and their government pawns. The SEC, Gary Gensler, Justice Department, FBI, and all of Congress need to be recode. And we have a tweet here. It says, well over 60% of Americans now live paycheck to paycheck. Three people own more wealth than the bottom half of American society. Got that? That's one, two, three people with more wealth than the bottom 165 million people. That is insane. And this ape said, you know what's also not helping? A stock market where payment forward or flow, counterfeit share, selling, shorting, algorithmic trading, and dark pools allow the 1% to steal the entire planet's savings. Congress is complicit. Congress, criminals, stock market, SEC, Wall Street, and Citadel scandal. 